so I was weirding myself out because I was like, should I do a journal video or should I try to do a vlog video? And the fact that the two are different is like a huge issue. Why am I just so afraid? Why can't I just post stuff? Why do I have to post something perfect and well thought out? And like, I don't know. That's just so fake. And I'm not, I'm not about that. I'm so not about that. So, like, why am I worried what people think or if they think that I'm not being clever enough or smart enough? I think that might be one of the reasons that I stopped doing my vlog, even though I was like, oh, it's time. I don't have enough time, which was true. But I was, like, overwhelming. Like, this pressure of I need to produce really good content or I need to be interesting or I need to be funny. Because just me is not enough. And you know what? Me, okay, this is a tricky subject because I am enough, to quote Sierra, <laughs> so enough, it's unbelievable how enough you are, and yet that doesn't mean that I need to have a million people following me. And that doesn't mean that if I, if I do decide to just post something like this where I'm not knowing what I'm saying, that people will all of a sudden follow me or something. Because that's not the point. And that's never been the point. The point is not to be followed. The point is to just speak. To speak into the void. To to have ideas and to have thoughts and to help and encourage and be somebody who's not just living around their own life but who's wanting to reach out and maybe we can all help each other to be a better person and to live more fully and to have more joy and like we don't do that by staying in our bubble and that doesn't mean the vlog is the right thing for me but I'm just so sick of being afraid about it, and I'm just tired of feeling like anything I do has to be perfect before anyone can see it. I know that that's super common. Oh, gosh, I mean, it me as a child. Like, I would never let my parents read anything I wrote because it wasn't finished or it wasn't good enough. Nothing. Like, it's it's so vulnerable to let somebody see something that we haven't perfected. And yet, it's not like we are our perfected selves. It's like Instagram. People talk about how it's like, oh, this is my perfect life because I'm only sharing the perfect moments. That's what it's like. And you can't get around that in social media. But I wish that we could. And now I'm just ranting, but I think I came on here to say something. I don't know. <laughs> I guess I'm not. I guess I am still on subject because I was talking about not doing vlogs because it had to be perfect and I can't be on a pillow on the couch in my pajamas and I'm like, that's lame. Like, who wants to watch that? That'll make them sleepy and they'll feel awkward. <laughs> But I'm tired. I'm so tired. I stayed up so late last night and today has been exhausting. And so I got into my pajamas and it's 8.30 and I want to go to bed and that is fine. And it's fine that I'm in my pajamas and nobody has to watch this. I don't even know if I'm going to post it. I have no clue. I'm just talking to the camera because this is what I do when I need to process what I'm thinking about. But this is probably really long and so I need to stop it. But, wow, I just had this weird moment where it said 4.50 and I was like, does that mean I have, I'm halfway to five? But no, it's 60. This is the dumb system anyway. Basically, we just need to stop 
having to be perfect to be seen. Whether that's in our home, whether it's our appearance, like, like I don't need to put makeup on to go outside of my house. Um, and I, that's not always true of me. I'm just saying that should be always true, but basically there's no reason. There's no reason to be like that. If we truly want people to love us as we are, if we, let me take that back. The goal is not having people loving us. The goal is loving people. And so when we're focused on loving people, then it doesn't really matter if our house is messy or if our video is unedited or if we don't have makeup on because we're not the point. Yeah. So there. Good night.